come in, come in. Ah, there you are. Well, you could color me impressed. Why? Well, it's because of your excellence. You have fantastic grades as of so far, and your training is going perfectly. That's good to see. I guess the UA heroes still know what they're doing. <laughs> uh, have a seat. I called you here today because I feel like this would make you happy as well. As alongside a lot of other people. But it also might make people scared. Well, that reason is that my son wants to be a hero. Did she... <laughs> Not that son. No, not that one either. For the past few months, I've been talking to my other son. He says he's sick of hiding. He doesn't want to be who he wants to be anymore. And so, for the past few months, I've been taking my son to rehab and rehabilitation. It's been months since then, and now he has fully gained control back into his own mind, and is no longer under the influence of someone who is evil. I'm telling you this because I feel like you would be happy, because I can sense in you you'd rather see a happy person than a broken one. Am I correct? So, I would like to say that my son, formerly known as the villain Darby, is becoming a hero and is studying here in UA. Although he's already very skilled, I'm going to be marking him down as a third year, and he will be taking the same class as you are. Because I want to put you on a secret mission. Yes, the surprise was saying that my son wants to be a hero. But I'm putting you in the same classes as him. Because I want you to keep an eye on him. I don't fully trust him yet. He says he's all good in the head. He's trained properly with professionals to teach them the rights from wrongs. But I have that sudden urge in my brain that he's lying. Manipulating, if you could say. Just to get closer to the heroes at UA. So, I want you to keep an eye on him. Do you accept this mission? Very good. I knew I could count on you. You seemed a very gifted person. And you seem like you want to help out as much as you can. And I'm glad to have you on our side. So, besides all this exciting news, how has you been? Have you been good? I'm glad. At least our students are getting to know you. I've seen you talk with a few of them, actually. Especially that one boy, Sero. He seems like a very good boy. And very interesting to hang out with. Mm -hmm. I hear you also have an older sibling who's in southern Japan. Am I correct? Hmm. They're a traveling agent. What are they 
do, if you do not mind me asking. World photographer. I see. So your brother, he takes photos of the world. Like a traveler. Hmm, he wanted to see the world and capture it in his own image. I see. Very well. Well, tell your brother to send me a postcard or somewhere. If he goes out of Japan, I would really like to see the photos he takes, because I'm very interested about other people's cultures. Mm-hmm. Besides that, everything seems like everything is in order. As of right now, your grades are good, your training has been up to date, Everything seems good. What's wrong? You still seem nervous about something. It's about Dobby, isn't it? <sighs> Look. That's... I'm not as spectacle as everyone else is about it. For everyone who taught me or told me about him wanting to become a hero. Do you know who the first person that Dobby went to to tell them that they don't want to be a villain anymore? He went straight to his mother. And then to Shoto. And then to me. Seems like he cares more about his family than his own father. must have changed him somehow. I'm not sure. But at least I'm happy that my son is back, and I don't have to worry about fighting him any longer. But just in case, I'm having you watch him. So you can put a stop to it at the right time. I trust my son, and I do love him very so. Damn his temper, and all of those thoughts he's been gaining. I know I do not have a bright past. I know, I have suffered long enough to have my family hide in the shadows. So, I want all of my family to become heroes, so we can change our last names. Change it into something that people do not want to fear. I want us to be seen as heroes. You understand that, right? So please, watch over Dobby. I thank you. Gratefully, I thank you. Also, you better call your brother after we're done here. I've been hearing there's been lots of seismic activity happening more down south in Japan. I think there might be another big earthquake coming up soon. So, call your brother and tell them I don't want them to get hurt. Yes, I do know about the more, less modern ways of the southern Japan. They still use the terms shinobis and hashira. I find it very odd. We are in the time of the future. We do have technology, but they choose to be less modern. More traditional, if I should say so. I don't understand it, but it's their culture. So I'm not going to say anything more about it. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> you're getting a text from someone. Well, if you're getting invited somewhere, you can leave now. 
That's all I wanted to tell you, really. Yes, I'm completely sure. <laughs> all right. You have a good day. I remember the school motto, which I really dislike and I need to change, but... You will have to keep going, plus ultra. Alright, have a good day. <laughs>